your thoughts on today's uh, scrimmage and practice? Disjointed, you know. I, I don't know that I'd call it a scrimmage, but uh, we had the team period down here. Uh, I thought it was disjointed. I thought we flew around pretty good. I thought, uh, you know, we're, we're, we're improving. I think, uh, but I thought, I thought today we were up and down. And I thought, uh, uh, this was kind of the one day that we were kind of up and down. You know, there'd be good effort. Somebody get the upper hand, then they'd lay down. Then the other side get the upper hand, then they'd lay down. And then, uh, you know, the thing we're still battling, which I, I one thing I thought our practice before this was pretty good because I thought the execution was a little better. There's a little higher level of uh, consistency. Here we're back to a series of explosives. Um, but with that said, I mean, it's better than I, if you would have asked me before any of this started how, how I thought it would be. Um, I w you know, we're better than I thought we would be, and, and, and so I'm happy with that. You know, we're, we're in a situation now where we've got a lot of guys emerging. We've got a lot of freshmen, a lot of sophomores. You know, some guys are better than they think they are, and uh, some guys can play better than they think they can, and they just got to go out and do it. And then once in a while you've got a guy or two that's not as good as they think they are, and, uh, you know, they just need to focus, develop skills, do little things. But uh, uh, encouraged. It's to be expected, but you always hope for a little better. You talk about your receiving core and maybe just some uh, sort of highlights you see out of those tall, guys. Tall, good speed mixed in. Uh, the ability to make explosive plays, uh, I think, and not as consistent as we need to be, uh, not as physical as we need to be. We need to block better. You know, right now uh, we get too many guys buying into the notion that we're receivers, we're not physical. I've never had a good receiver that wasn't physical, that wouldn't get after somebody. I've had skinny guys, I've had tall guys, I've had t short guys, but uh, I haven't had anybody that uh, uh, once they start playing well that didn't realize that they, if I don't block, I don't play. And uh, uh, there's some of them that, that I think right now that think they may play whether they block or not, and that's not the case. With the defense making changes, um, does that play into maybe some of the lulls that you guys are going into offensively, just seeing different things on the other side? Well, I think both sides went into the lulls. I think, and I think you know what I, I like about our defense is our defense is a group. You know, they, they try to win it on the defensive side of the ball too. I mean, it's not just an absorbed thing. And uh, you know, deliberately they have a lot of stuff in, and deliberately, uh, you know, we don't script out when we blitz. Uh, uh, we want them firing it so it's random, like like they need to do in the game, and 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 we want to face it that way. You know, I mean, we're better uh, to learn it from these guys and out in the streets. I thought our old line in uh, in drills, I thought were a little ragged. I thought in team, I thought they played pretty well. Uh, and right now we're doing, you know, right now it's kind of a cross between overly conscientious and turning it loose. You've got to be conscientious if you're going to develop your skills, but you can't have a clouded mind if you're going to turn it loose. So we're trying to hit that balance there. And I, uh, but I am pleased with, uh, you know, some of the stuff we're doing. We're not one of those guys that script this and everybody knows when they're blitz and knows when they're dropping. I mean, no, nah, we want, we want to recognize and react to it both sides of the ball. And, and I think, and we've seen some really good things that way too. But with that said, uh, you know, there's going to there's gonna be some breakdowns. All of a sudden, some guy comes here and what, 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 what? Or, you know, the other thing is, uh, you know, some guy blitzes, the other guy's supposed to cover, and he's out of position, and stick him with the ball, and then off he goes. You might leave out that one deal. <laughs> so. Uh, how about Jeff Tool's performance, and now he's coming along? Not pretty good. Say, uh, I think I think right now trying to absorb a lot. Uh, I think trying to absorb a lot of stuff, and I think uh, uh, yeah, you know, it, it, it's it's. Uh, I think uh, has picked up a lot, and I think he reacts. Uh, I think he, he reacts to a lot of things quickly, uh, uh, more quickly than expected. Uh, but with that said, without all the stuff he's got, uh, I, I think sometimes. Uh, sometimes he, uh, uh, you know, overthinks it or is slow to react. And part of it, we just we just got to have reps. You know, I mean, it's one thing to see it on film, recognize it, know what to do, and then react sharply uh, in that split second thing. And, and, and the other thing I think is uh, is getting used to the receivers. You know, get a lot of balls. Okay, this guy does it this way. That guy does it that way. I think very impressive based on how many reps he's uh, he's had. Because you know, if you think about, it, he didn't get a lot of reps last season. 
uh, you know, and, and, and uh, but I, th I think doing really well. I think his leadership quality is really good. What, what can you tell about your receivers in a scrimmage setting that you wouldn't get just from normal team session and practice? Uh, well, I think it, it, it goes a little faster. I think the plays are faster, and I think the things uh, uh, happen a little faster. Uh, and I'll tell you, and I, and I saw a little of this on both sides, uh, one thing that happens is uh, sometimes they make more out of it than what it is and then evolve into street ball, you know, rather than just your assignment and technique, then it's just, you know, kind of a run and get open type of deal, you know. And so, uh, like, I thought we had a lot more precision and scale than came down here, and so, uh, 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 you know, and there's all that stuff. And so I think uh, you get that out of your system a little bit. Didn't see Connor's his status changed at all? Uh, he's doing great. He's uh, got a family deal he's taken care of, and uh, we couldn't be more excited. I mean, we're going to have a very thrilling uh, uh, film meeting uh, uh, and, and can't wait to see him back there because I think that's going to be exciting for all of us. Uh, uh, so, yeah, yeah, we're looking forward to seeing him again. And he's only been gone a couple hours, but we miss him. <laughs> Coach, you get a sense that guys are are buying in to maybe the expectation level of where you want oh, to practice. I, I think there's no question about that. I, I think, uh, again, I think we kind of battled the conscientious thing, you know. Everybody does, you know, everybody does. You, you say, execute, do it this way. Where's your hand? Where's your eyes? Where's your foot? Okay, and you do that over and over and over and over. And, uh, and uh, well, then pretty soon you say, now go fast, you know. Well. Okay, now my foot, my hand, my, my, you know, and, and so I, it's a fine line. We got their minds clouded, there's no question. And, and, um, and I think we've done a pretty good job pulling the trigger when you consider that um, everybody's installing everything for the first time. Uh, but we're not as consistent at pulling the trigger as we need to. I mean, you need their eyes there, you need their foot there, you need, you know, their hips like that, okay? But then by the same token, uh, at some point when you, you line up and snap the ball, you know, you got to pull the pin. Coach Russell always says, pull the pin. Hey, so, so uh, but, uh, so we got, but really conscientious and focused and trying to work hard and want to do well. And I think that, uh, uh, you know, with that said, I mean, there's times you just turn it loose too. And I think we're getting closer and closer.